One of the most common questions I get on my videos is how to use EQ or how to adjust the EQ for your mic. And I want to tell you guys right now that that issue has just gone away forever with the drop of Wave's new plugin, Curves Equator. Now, the best way to describe this plugin is if you've ever heard of Soothe, it's very similar to that. But this one is just so much simpler to use and you can get so much more surgical with it. I'm going to show you guys exactly how to use it and just how quickly you can just apply a perfect EQ. Also, if you want to grab this plugin, I just partnered with Waves to give you guys a crazy discount on it. So if you click the link down in the description below, you're going to get one of the best discounts on this plugin. And I'm telling you, it's a lot cheaper than you think it is. But let's jump in. I'm gonna show you guys how this actually works. All right, so here we are. I'm working on this new project. I'm just gonna show you guys what it sounds like with the EQ on and then with it off. And then we're gonna dive into some of the different ways you can actually use this. And I'm telling you, there are a lot of different ways. So this is what the plugin looks like. Um, as you can see, the first one is like our main EQ and I'm not really doing anything besides you use this knob right here to drag up and down how much of the EQ you actually want. So as you bring it down, the more EQ is going to be applied. And if you want less EQ, you just bring this knob up. I had it somewhere over here. But as you can see, there's two instances and this eq i kind of was using to bring out some of the low end and that's the cool part about it you can add nodes we'll get into that later but let me just show you guys what this is actually doing what it looks like and what it sounds like so this is with both of the eqs on in the song As you can see, this is doing all of the work for us. And what I mean by that is when you EQ, you would usually get pretty surgical and pull out some of the frequencies that are a little too harsh. So if we play this again and you look at the blue up top, so it's going to be like right around here, you can see what it's actually pulling out. And as you can see, it's pulling out a lot of the low end because this mic usually does have a lot of low end in it. And if I were to go like this, you're going to see that that blue is going to come in a lot more. It's going to really mess with the EQ. And then if you click this button right here, you could actually listen to what it's removing. So let's click this. So that gives you an idea for what it's actually doing. It just allows you to slap something on EQ and it sounds great. And also you can mess with these buttons right here. Tilting it will just, if you want the vocal to be higher, you could tilt it up, which just make it sound a lot higher. Like if you want those higher frequencies versus if you tilt it the other way, you could hear some of those lower frequencies. Yeah, the mansion came with helipads. Told this bitch that I'm too crazy, I'm heaven sent. You'd also mess with this down here, pink, warm, or flat, which is just going to give pink is going to be a brighter sound. Warm is going to be warmer sound, a little less bright as pink, but still warm. And then flat is just going to be your flat response. Now you could also click this learn button to do it automatically. So we'd click this and then play. Yeah, the mansion came with helipads. Told this bitch that I'm too crazy. Yeah, I'm heaven sent. I'll stay my bitter, yeah, I made it out the internet. And honestly, that is really nice because that once it learns, you could pretty much just keep it like this and you could see it's using your voice and what's coming into the mic to apply a curve that fits your mic as, as well as possible. It's probably as well as you would be able to do it, honestly. And then you could just use this to increase reduction or decrease it based on how much you want the EQ to be applied. Yeah, the mansion came with helipads. Told this bitch that I'm too crazy, yeah. Let's see what this sounds like in context. Yeah, the mansion came with helipads. Told this bitch that I'm too crazy, yeah, I'm heaven sent. I'll stay my bitter, yeah, I made it out the internet. She seen my bank account, she said it don't make any sense. The way I move, move with these states is like I'm heavy sick. She talking money, but she put up in her daddy's bands. Now, this is definitely a mixing phase. I don't think you can really record with this. There is a decent amount of latency, I've noticed. So you usually want to do this at once you're into your mixing phase. But I'm telling you, this just makes EQ so easy. Easy. It's actually insane. And we're not done there. Now I want to show you guys just some different things you could apply it on. So I'm going to solo out the beat. And in the video, they were actually doing this. It's pretty cool. So if you just uh, click the curves equator, and we're just going to learn from the beat.
and honestly on the beat it makes it sound pretty good too it makes it a lot more in your face especially when you adjust the sensitivity which is basically adjusting the attack and the release and how fast it's actually like compressing the certain eq points let's hear this with the vocals now and then one more quick thing we're gonna do is we could apply it to the master which i also saw them do in the video which is pretty cool so you could get a quick little help with your master right here so we're gonna just click learn play it I don't know if you can tell the difference there, but it's way brighter and just way more controlled. So honestly, this is one of my new favorite plugins. Like I said, if you guys do want to grab this, head down to the link in the description. I partnered with Waves to give you guys one of the best discounts you could get on this plugin. Yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that real quick. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, let me know. If you want to hear this song or more of it, at least, let me know. I'll drop this or something, or we could just do a video on how I made it and stuff like that. Stay tuned for the next video. It will be a preset video, so we'll be back in action. But I'll see you guys in the next one. Deuces. Put a check up on my wrist